Thanks to the ultra-low crawler gears, the torque of this beast is multiplied a whopping 32 times, allowing operators to pull more in one load than most are dare. But what would you tow with one of these? The iShift with ultra-low crawler gears in this truck is Volvo's flagship transmission for heavy haulage work. It's basically a standard iShift with a couple of crawler gears. Well, in the real world, that takes this truck's 3,150 newton metres of torque up to about 100,000. That means it'll pull nearly three times as much. Hi, I'm Ian Robertson. Uh, I've been in the heavy haulage game for about 25 or 26 years. Um, uh, it's what I do. Over the years, I've driven many heavy trucks, and I've been given the opportunity to drive the, uh, the new Volvo here. It's been a very nice truck, comfortable. It's uh, certainly got the goods. It's uh, got all the power and everything that you need to do the job. This is the really cool part. They've actually closed the Pacific Highway and we've got about a 15 minute window to get that girder out of the yard and to the site. See how we go. When we lift off, applying the uh, throttle gently, you can feel the torque coming in and it just lifts off and wants to go. I find the eye shift really smooth. You can keep revving to as high as you want. It's just so smooth when you change and the torque that's there, it's uh, quite phenomenal. Have not had any issues with braking traction and, and that's on a wet night when we're coming onto the bridge. No, no loss of traction in the, in the mud, no, no braking traction. people on this job site and currently the place is a ghost town. Everybody stopped and they're relying on Robbo to get that girder into place. It's all on him now. Visibility is great. So much machinery and equipment around you, you just got to be able to see everywhere. It's got a great sun visor with the electric button. Love it. Reversing up with the 300 ton has been no effort at all. The crawler gear in reverse has just pushed it right back, no effort at all. Yes, you'll have a hard time getting me out of it. 